Hello everyone, welcome to study a -Tech. This is solution of transformer MCQ questions. All these questions are taken from 2008 to 2017 WBUT semester papers. You can find all these questions in our website. Go to your Chrome browser or any web browser and uh, in Google, let it come. Type uh, study e -tech. okay. So you will find this is our YouTube channels and Twitter, Facebook page and click here. Okay. And in important tab, you go to the transformer MCQ questions. Okay. Click here. You will find all the questions. They are available in our website. Answers are given in this YouTube video series. We are discussing the answers of all these MCQ questions. Okay. So let's start. Well, the first question is the maximum efficiency of the transformer. Okay, this is about transformer efficiency. As we know that I'm giving you the explanation of this question. The answer will be definitely the iron loss equal to the copper loss. So the explanation for this question is transformer efficiency equal to output that is V2 I2 cos phi the output by input input equal to output e2 i2 cos phi plus the losses the iron loss pi plus the i2 square r okay the i square r loss okay so this is a efficiency now to find out the maximum efficiency we can write down this uh, equation in the another form v2 cos phi divided by v2 cos phi plus pi by i2 plus i2 r okay so from here we can say the efficiency of the transformer will be maximum eta will be high means maximum the this part denominator v2 cos phi plus pi by i2 plus i2 square r has to be minimum right for this minimum variable is i2 others are constant so taking the derivative d d i2 of this whole portion this denominator will be zero okay so making that this constant term will constant will be zero derivative of this will be zero and this portion will be minus pi by i2 square plus this square will not be there i have done a big mistake okay so ir so it will be plus this derivative is equal to r equal to zero and that will make pi equal to i square r so the pi is the iron loss i square r is the copper loss so iron loss has to be equal to the copper loss this will be the answer okay next question the transformer core is laminated to reduce in transformer two losses happens one is hysteresis loss another is ad current loss to minimize the hysteresis loss you need to use a good material and to reduce the ad current loss laminate laminate the core okay so the answer will be laminated to reduce the ad current loss next question the unit of the magnetic flux magnetic flux is uh, over per meter square and that is nothing but the tesla okay so this will be the answer next question in a transformer the electric power is transformed from the primary to the secondary without changing look the transformer is basically a coupling device okay the transformer is basically the coupling device there is another circuit there is another circuit and based on the mutual induction so there is no change in frequency okay only only the voltage levels are up down or current levels are up down the power is transferred from one circuit to another circuit they are not electrically connected but they are connected via this magnetic flux okay so we can say the without change in frequency this will be the answer but current voltage all these things changes power is constant so so this is the thing the transformer frequency is constant remember this thing next question which of the following is not true for the leakage flux what is leakage flux first understand then you will be able to um, answer this question the leakage flux is if this is your transformer okay so the coil sir is the primary side let's say look this is a primary and this is a this is our secondary say what is a leakage flux leakage flux <coughs> what is a main flux main flux is the flux which is linking both of the coils okay and some of the flux will not be linking this one some of the flux will be 
through the air here and some of the flux will be through the air here so they are called the liquid so <clears throat> it is not linking with both of the coils okay so mm, which is uh, not true not true which is not true it links both winding through air okay, then links the primary winding through here it links the secondary through words it doesn't link the both the windings okay so the answer will be let me it links both the winding through the, both the winding definitely not it links the primary winding through here it can be the primary winding or the secondary winding okay okay so they are asking which is not true i got a bit ambiguity so mm, this is true this is not the pri this can be linking with the primary winding this can be linking with the secondary winding it definitely uh, uh, this is true this does not link the both of the winding okay so this is not true okay it links both the winding through here this is not true so this is a correct answer okay next question what is done to balance the mmf setup due to the secondary current okay so let let's uh, have a look on this question this is a bit interesting question okay so this is a transformer the conceptual question basically this is the transformer assume and what is it saying what is done to balance the mmf setup due to the secondary okay so in the primary what happens it is connected the coil is connected to the primary and there is a coil in the secondary so whenever current flows in the secondary i2 current flows in the secondary so there is a secondary flux is induced okay secondary flux okay so secondary flux actually opposes the main flux is a main flux phi m phi m is opposed when phi m is opposed this e1 will reduce e1 is reduced meaning this i1 will increase when i1 will increase it will take more current from the supply so you can think it in this way basically this is a this is a uh, transformer is a coupling device between this circuit and this circuit whenever this circuit the secondary circuit draws more current from here it will take the current from the primary circuit okay so so to keep the flux constant so the answer will be the current in the primary is increased whenever the current is not flowing it will draw a minimum amount of current to set up the flux and for the the hysteresis loss okay the no load loss and then whenever the current is flowing it will draw extra current so there is a reflection of the secondary current in the primary okay so basically the answer will be the current in the primary is increased okay what is the next question is it there questions okay so this is the end of this lecture okay so hope you have liked the video please uh, share among your friends who are in need and subscribe the channel to get the notification for the further video press the bell icon okay so thank you